Hi there guys, it's Chrissy with SelfMyNewbie.com and in this video we're going to go through the best gutter guards currently out there today. I've tried to keep this list as comprehensive as possible so no matter what your needs are, there'll definitely be something in this list for you. So before we jump in, drop a like, subscribe, turn on the bell if you want to be updated with new videos. Okay, so as usual, I'm going to skip the fluff and just dive right in and if you want to confirm what these recommendations are, you can go into the description there and check out my list. So I'm gonna kick it off, not save the best to last, but just jump into my favorite overall. And this is the Raptor Gutter Guard Stainless Steel Micro Mesh. So these are made from high quality stainless steel micro mesh. It's durable, it's effective at keeping out large and small debris. Very easy to install. And also if you use your gutters to collect rainwater for future use, these are gonna be the best gutter guards for you as well because that micro mesh is fine enough to keep out small particles from contaminated your, your collected water as well. So they also are gonna keep out large items like leaves and even animals, but also, you know, pine needles, dirt and insects as well. So these are a bit pricey though, between $2 per foot. Uh, but the package holds 12 panels. Uh, but given that they work for so many situations and they're so durable, uh, that's the reason um, I'm putting them at my top spot. So that's the only con really, they're expensive, but the pros, works well with all gutters, very easy to install. The micro mesh I really like, super durable, and it's gonna keep out both small and large particles as well. Now the next one on my list, uh, if you are worried about price, this is gonna be my best budget recommendation and this is the Gutter Glove Stainless Steel Micro Mesh Gutter Guard and this comes in a 10 pack. So leaves and pine needles are two of the most common nuisances uh, that cause people to look into getting gutter guards. Uh, and this is one of the best for these problems. Also effective on dirt and grit from your shingles and even small insects it's gonna catch as well. This is another micro mesh gutter guard, so great option. And these come in increments of four feet. So if you only need smaller sections, this is a great option and it's gonna keep costs low as well while still giving you protection. It's another easy to install option and you can use the included 3M tape to secure the gutter guard, although it's probably better to reinforce with self tapping screws. So what I like about this, it comes with all installation hardware. Again, it's micro mesh as well. Um, and it comes in those four feet panels. Now, if you want something even smaller, that might be a con, uh, like the last one I recommended. Um, if, if you want two foot panels, it might be a better choice. The next one on my list is my recommendation for the best screen. And this is uh, from Superior Gutter Guards. So the raised screen on these uh, draws in rainwater into the gutter. The guards are also micro mesh and they work to keep leaves, pine needles, dirt, insects, etc., out of your gutter. Um, so really the only thing getting through is water. Uh, and while you likely can't see the design or enjoy how it looks, you can be happy knowing that it is funneling water where it needs to go. These are designed also for a DIY installation. So the purchase comes with self-tapping screws and a driver bit to get them installed quickly. So it's really uh, everything you need for a solid screen. The cons are, I feel like you might need to have a few extra screws, uh, but what I do like is the screen design that funnels the water. Again, another micro mesh. And also that it's just a package that's gonna come with all the hardware you need for that DIY installation. Now the next one on my list is gonna to go to my best brushed option and this is the gutter brush gutter guard. So this concept uh, behind the gutter guard brush is pretty simple. A stiff bristle brush rests inside the gutter to take up space that would otherwise become clogged with leaves, pine needles and whatnot and other debris. So with the brush in place, rainwater flows freely uh, around it without being obstructed. And the nice thing about the brush is you can simply just set it in your gutter without needing any tools. And this brush also has multiple width and length options, as well as a helpful sizing guide. A brush can accumulate leaves and debris, uh, but you still come out ahead because less gunk is gonna accumulate in your gutter simply because the space is already being taken up. It works a little bit differently from the micro mesh as you might still get the impression that your gutter is clogged, but you'll still find that water is flowing freely uh, underneath. What I like about this, simple to install, you're not gonna need any screws or hardware tools, and the water is still gonna flow freely. They are a bit expensive though, and the debris can accumulate a little bit on top because of the way those needles are sticking out, it might catch a little bit, um, and it can become slightly unhinged over time because it isn't really secured in place uh, like a screwed in mesh 
um, guard would be. And the next one on my list is a similar sort of concept. And this is gonna go to the best foam gutter guard. And this is the gutter foam easy. So this is gonna be one of the, also the most economical options as well. So these appear similar to pool noodles and fit right into gutters as well to keep debris out. And the big benefit is they keep also mosquitoes at bay. The gutter foam easy gutter guard is treated also to withstand solar UV rays and has a germicide to help prevent harmful viruses such as West Nile and Zika. Unfortunately though, because it's foam, they can actually keep water out of the gutter as well. So the light rain filters through the foam and into the gutter fast enough though to avoid build up really, but water from heavy rain might accumulate on top of the foam faster than it filters. So it is sort of gonna be a slower process because of that. Um, water, the water does need somewhere to go. Um, and it just, for me, you do run the risk of that water may, maybe going into other parts of the roof or your walls even. Um, so if you do get heavy thunderstorms, you probably should avoid this one. But what I do like, economical, treated to prevent insect-borne illnesses, the UV resistance as well, but obviously the cons, like I just mentioned, not great for heavy rain or bad, really bad weather locations. All right, guys, so hopefully there's something on that list for you, whether you're looking for a simple install, whether you're looking for micro mesh, uh, four feet, two feet, something that you can install yourself, whatever. Uh, hopefully there's something in there anyway. So if you do have any questions, feel free to drop them there in the comments. And if you found value in this video, it really helps out if you drop a like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.